That's Jim Owens, and that's the Mach E. This is the Mach E GT. It is parked right next to our 2021 Mustang internal combustion engine Mach 1. I'm a witness. 480 horsepower in the Mach 1, 420 foot pounds of torque, our pinnacle five liter performance car that we've ever done for a production standpoint. has 480 horsepower, 420 foot pounds of torque. This one behind me, 480 horsepower and over 600 pound feet of torque. So the four door Mustang is going to blow away the two door Mustang. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what you're saying, basically. Zero to 60 in the mid threes. Yeah. Right? That's, that's, that's it's a, it's hard to. It's my Shelby GT500 yeah. <laughs> 0 and, to 60. And the car doesn't go like this. It just no, goes it's bing. torque. It's instantaneous, yeah. right? I mean, when you come in, boom, and you go in there. But then on top of it, what we did was we, on the GT Performance Package, so we took the Brembo calipers. You take the Magnaride suspension. You take the design from the Mustang and the proud front end that you get. You wouldn't see it on an electric vehicle, right? That changes Americans' opinion of what driving electric is about and what better way to do it than with the Mustang as part of the Mustang family. Let's turn the camera around and it'll go over details in this Mach E. As you see first, the hood line, right? That sloping nose that comes down that matches the Mustang. The wheel lip that kind of comes down over here and matches the Mustang. Performance Pirelli tires. And you have four piston Brembo brakes wow. that actually help the stopping power of the vehicle. Oh, yes, they do. From its performance section. Does it, with the electric, doesn't it, when you let off the gas, doesn't it actually slow itself down without even the brakes? Um, there are some of those things that are controlled in the electronics right. to help that, but this is when your performance Mustang Heck driving, yeah, heck yeah. Right? And what you want deep down in places you don't go at night, you want those four piston Brembo's <laughs> on there, right? True. When you're doing zero to 60 and three and mid threes, you want to be able to hit you the brakes and yeah. stop. You can drive fast, but you know how you can stop. You can stop and always <laughs> drive safely on the road. But like when you're on the track and you're autocrossing this, that's when you want to hit those four piston Brembo's. Thanks, Jim. That is cool. But as you go from a visual perspective, it is the same hood slope line as your Mach 1, the blue one back there. It, it has those abilities, and the, oh, the pony pony tri bar lights on the back, right? I mean, you got to have the sequential like, pony tri bar lights on the back, and of course the GT badge, right? Which was you know before the Mach One, the GT was the pinnacle of Mustang performance until you get to the 350s that Carol and his merry band of hot rodders put together. But all of those components together with the brakes, with the performance tires and the Magna Ride suspension and the 480 horsepower and 600 pound feet of torque, that is what makes it true Mustang and a welcome member of the Mustang Corral. Thank you, Jim. I always love talking to oh, Mustangs with you. Yes, you're too kind. <laughs> it's about Ford, it's about our history, it's about America. Remember that.